Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Little Harry Potter Years 5 through 7. Last episode we unlocked the the Deluminator, Hermione's bag, and also Apparition. So now we can apparate uh, normally. That's gonna be used quite a bit, especially here in year seven part one. Um so it's just gonna be mostly just apparating. It, we're just gonna be mostly using using apparition to get into like story levels and stuff. But this area is the same area outside the Leaky Cauldron as before. It's just the weather has changed. Uh, but there's a few things that we can do out here for now. If you want to go back to Diagon Alley, you can. Um, and actually, you'll be able to return to Diagon Alley pretty much at any point um, as before. He, like when you were at Hogwarts and stuff earlier. But yeah, we can use the Deluminator to open this door. And get Rufus Scrimmager, the uh, Mr. Magic. There's a couple of graffiti things that we can wash off with Aguamente. There's not too many of these graffiti things in this game, but there's a few of them, and you don't need to wash off all of them. There's only a few that you actually have to. As far as like, as far as like the polyjuice potion for for story levels, you don't need actually need the characters. But anyway, let's go in the coffee shop. attack we got a couple of death eaters in disguise here the first thing you want to do is raise up the table and you'll want to hide behind, behind the table so these guys can't hit you and then when they come go to throw something at you just get a, get in line and throw it back make sure you zap them after guy and let's again just kind of hide behind the table here so they don't get hit by the stuff that they're that they're dropping from the ceiling just wait and then just, just kind of play the wing game here he's gonna hit the, the light fixture and, and the, the spell's gonna deflect back on him. It's kind of funny. And got, this guy is gonna do the same thing. Okay, now for this part, we just have to, we have to wait. And this guy, this is Dolaha, but you know, the black hair guy is Dolaha, and the other guy is Rowl, I think it is. But yeah, just throw the stuff back at him and zap him again. Okay, he's down, and now for Rowl. Okay, he's gonna throw the cake. Just throw it right back at him. And zap him.
Okay, so uh, we're we're going to be going to the ministry, but first we're gonna explore the coffee shop a little bit more now that that thing that's open here and the Death Eaters cleared out. We can now explore this area. We'll be coming back here later to, of course, in free room. But there's a few things we can do here now, so might as well get as much done as we can now. There's a bunch of stuff here that you can just do for studs. And you can also come back here in the kitchen. And we lot unlock the waitress here that works here at the uh, coffee shop. Unlocking a bunch of a bunch of stuff here. I'm just trying to do all the things that just trying to do everything that I, can, that I remember you're supposed to do. I think that's all we can do in here for right now. So now we're gonna be heading to the Ministry of Magic. I was just kind of checking, just to make sure I wasn't missing anything, but I'm not. All right, so let's continue. I should have known we weren't going to see the last of Umbridge. Anyway, of course, Hermione is a tier here, so we're not going to be able to do anything about that book bookcase right right now. Building 
the decoy detonator uh, thing here. Uh, Fred and George actually have the, the decoy detonators as their pets. Um, so if you play as Fred and George and you use their pet option on the spell wheel, they'll they'll summon a decoy detonator. So it's kind of funny. So like Ron here, disguised as Reg Catamol, has the still has the the Deluminator. This is kind of funny. Alright, so there's two keys here that we have to find. That's the first one. The second one here is on Umbridge's desk. After this, we're gonna go and confront the old toad once and for all. Head down to the court, the courtrooms. And to confront our umbridge and get the locket here. Also, get used to throwing stuff back at people here. This is 
this is the part of the game where you're gonna have to start getting, where you're gonna have to get good at it because there's a lot of this in this in year seven part one. Yaxley wants to duel here. Yaxley's a death leader. done but not quite yet Did the wrong had the wrong spell selected there. There we go. thing that we are going to have to worry about here, but it's pretty quick to get. It's to kind of stay to this side like what I'm doing. Alright, then run this way. Grab the house crest. Now we don't have to worry about that later. Now just keep running. So that's. Oh, I skipped some stuff. Oh, that's okay. Oh, oh dear, Ron's oh. arm got damaged. Huh? Oh. Simply destroy the locket. It's gonna take a little bit more power. Alright, more in the next episode. Until then, it's Joe Clotin signing out.